you might as well think of Nürburgring lap times as automotive folklore. Sure, there's some substance behind them, but 99 times out of 100, they're really little more than abstract bragging rights. Nevertheless, automotive enthusiasts cling to the idea of lapping Germany's green hell faster and faster and faster, which is exactly why it is so exciting to see Dodge bring a product like this to the 2014 SEMA show. As you probably remember, the previous Viper ACR was a street legal but track focused version of Dodge's V10 Monster that set a new Nürburgring lap record in its heyday. The Viper ACR on display beside me is only a concept car, but Dodge took a similar approach with the new car by stripping away unnecessary parts to save weight while adding a massive front lip and a rear spoiler to increase aerodynamic downforce. It rides on lightweight 19-inch wheels that hide massive 15.4-inch carbon ceramic two-piece brake rotors and six-piston Brembo calipers. Now, apart from the crazy aerodynamic kit that you can see on the outside of the car, Dodge also went ahead and ripped out as much as it possibly could in the name of saving weight. For example, the footwells don't have carpets anymore, there's no stereo amplifier, and Dodge removed all of the sound editing material, again in the name of lightening the vehicle. So far, sales of the Viper really haven't been very good. The company offers the more track-focused TA model, but really the only thing that seems to spur sales was the drop by $15,000 in the base MSRP. Based on that, it's really difficult to think that Dodge would actually build and offer something like the ACR concept, although it would be really cool if they did.